Hello, welcome to All Around the Board, and today I am starting a new series which is going to be the Carcassonne series. Today's video will just be the base game, I will just show you how to play that for those who don't know, but if you are interested in my future videos, I will be doing all of these expansions. We actually have the base game plus 15 expansions here. We also have the rules for the cooperative or solo variant, and we've also got some other variants such as Star Wars, Safari, South Seas, and any that we may get in the future. But without further ado, I will show you how to play through for the Carcassonne base game. Carcassonne is a tile laying game for two to six players. However, the main base game is actually only for five players. But if you get the big box expansion, it has all the pieces ready for a six player game. In this how to play through video, we are just playing with the two players because I'm being joined by the lovely Jade. The main aim of Carcassonne is to score the most points. What we will be doing is in the middle of this table here, eventually will be a big city that we will start creating and we will score points depending on how we build that. Keep on watching to find out how we get points. Before we show you the how to play through, we will just show you what you need to set up. So you will take eight meeples in your color and put one of them on the score track. No, I didn't just miscount, I know there's seven. So you'll have seven in your personal position and one on the score. Jade has also got her seven and one on the score. You'll then find the token that is a slightly different color back and you are gonna flip that up and put that in the middle of the play area. Now you do wanna put this in the middle of your table somewhere because the game is going to go off into different directions and you won't know which direction they will go until you start playing. Then shuffle all the remaining tiles. As you can see here, we've got six piles and we just shuffle them up and these are gonna be our draw piles. Now we are allowed to draw from any pile we want. Now you may be wondering why I've got all these tiles on the outside. Well, you guys have got to subscribe and keep following my channel to find out what I'm gonna do with all these expansions. So don't worry if you don't know the rules, I'm gonna go through them as we play through. So Jade is gonna take the first turn and very simply, all a player does on their turn is they are going to draw a tile and then we're gonna decide what we're gonna do with it. So Jade, if you'd like to draw a tile, uh, what have we got there? So we've got our first tile there, which is a monastery. So what you have to do, the first thing is you have to place your tile. Now you've got a few rules on placement. That is the only place that Jade can play. The reason being is you can have green on green, and you can have road on road, and you can have city on city. If Jade did that, for example, it's blocking the road, which isn't allowed. So her only place she can go is here. The next thing you may do is you can place a meeple on the tile that you just placed. So for this one is a monastery. Jade can place a meeple on there and what she will have to do is completely surround this tile to score nine points. So Jade, are you gonna place a meeple on that space? I am. So that meeple cannot come off until she completely surrounds it. This early on in the game though, I think you're gonna get that completed, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah. Jade's done her turn and I am going to go on to my go and I've got this one here. So this is just a simple road. So the first thing I have to do is I have to place it. So I can place it this side or the other, but I'm choosing to place it here. Then when I place a meeple, I have the choice to put it on this road here, which I will do. I'm gonna stand him up and put him on the road specifically. Once the road is completed at both ends, and it can, be, it can end up being a really long road. Once it is completed, you're gonna get one point for every tile with a road on in your control. You will see how that works later once I complete this road. Jade, it's back to you. So I've got part of a city. Uh, okay, so you've got a few choices here. You can link that bit of road. You can link that to either end, or you can add to the city, and we've got a city with a shield. I will explain what that symbol means depending on what Jade does on her turn. So I'm going to place it with the other city and claim it. Ah, okay. So she's putting her meeple specifically in the city. A city is considered complete once it has a full wall going all the way around. As you can see, this is not complete because you've got this edge just here. But once it is complete, you're going to get two points per tile that that city is on. So at the moment, this is two, four points. The other spin to that is if you have a shield, that doubles the points for that tile alone. So at the moment, this city is actually worth two, four, six, because that is worth double. Hopefully, I will get myself into that city and not let her have all those hmm. points, but we will see how that goes. It's also worth noting that Jade had the choice there. She could have either placed it and gone in the city or gone onto the road. But as I said earlier, roads are only worth one point per tile, whereas these are worth two points. 
This one specifically though is worth four points. So yes, that is the better place to go. Right, onto my go. I'm gonna grab a new tile and I have got this one. That would have been great to put there, but I don't wanna put it in her city. I want my own one. So I'm gonna put it in that corner there and I'm gonna grab one of my meeples available and I'm gonna go there. Again, that's a four point tile just there. So I'm done. Jade, it's onto your go. Right. See what we get here. Oh, look, I can join onto my city. Ah, uh, that's another four pointer. So that is actually worth four, eight, ten points. That city. Ah, oh, I need to get in there and share your points. Uh, okay, so back to me. I'm going to grab a tile. Uh, yeah, I'm going to add to my city just there. If you add to a feature that you already control, you cannot place another meeple in that space. The only other thing you can do is you can place a farmer. We'll talk about farmers later if it happens, but if I wanted to place a farmer, I'd put it in the green area of that tile. I don't want to do that though. Um, I'm just going to carry on as is. So right, it's back to you, Jade. Okay, what we've got now, ooh. So I could complete my city, which I am going to do. Nice, okay, so the first thing is you get to place a meeple. So we actually have three separate roads here. This is considered one end of the road. Jake could be really cheeky and put a meeple here, and if this road links, we would both score the points, or she can take one of those as her own road. She doesn't have to though, so what are you gonna do on that front? I'm gonna be cheeky. Ah, I thought you might. Okay, so we might end up sharing points. We'll see. Uh, and then she has completed this. So once you've completed a feature, we will then take the meeple off and we're going to score it. So it is 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12 points. So you go over to the score tracker there and she shoots up to 12 points. And yeah, that's, I mean, Jade's going to win, so I don't know why I should really continue. Once you've scored a feature, the meeple that you got goes back into your supply. On to Maggle. Uh, ah, here we go, one of the monasteries. I'm gonna go next to Jade so that we can try and help each other out. Um, I'm gonna place a meeple on there, and then it is on to your go, Jade. Right, let's see what I get this time. Ooh. What have you got? I've got this. Uh, okay, yeah. Which can be good, it can be bad. Let's go here. And I'm gonna claim that city there. Okay, I'm going to take this one. Oh, I've got another one of these. Um, where's that gonna go? I think I'm gonna help my own one out. And I'm gonna go up there and I'm gonna place one of my meeples there. This is bad news though, because I only get these meeples back once I've fully surrounded them. So it might not happen, we'll see. Okay, Jane, it's on to your go. Okay. And I, oh, I've got a road that will connect these two. Okay, so that's completed one end, but it's still not complete that end. Uh, it's onto me. Let's see if I get another monastery. No, I don't. I got one of these. Uh, right. I will put that up there. And it's still not completed the city, but I'm going to go ahead and take that road up the top there. Right, Jade, it's onto you. Okay, let's see what I get this time. Oh, another part of a road. Let's put that on there. <laughs> Make it all one longer. Making it even longer. What you could have done is actually started another road, and but that's up yeah. to you. Obviously, we can get the points to collectively for that. Uh, right, I've got another end of a city. I'm going to complete my city so I get some points. So I'm going to take this off, and I'm going to get two, four, six, eight, ten points. Not as much as Jade's, but you know, it's it's enough. Okay, Jade, it's back to yours. So I'll pop that road there. Yeah, and then you can place a meeple if you want to. I will do. And then you get to score the feature. So as you can tell, we ended up merging that road. Now normally, we're not allowed to take a feature that somebody is already on. But because these classed as two separate features that ended up merging by another tile, we will then see who's got the most on the road. At the moment we're tied, so both players will score that amount of points. So we're gonna score one, two, three, four, five, six, but that's each. Okay, so back to my turn, and I'm gonna grab this tile here. Uh, oh, looks like the starting tile. Um, I will put this, I'm gonna put that there, and I'm gonna add to this city just here. Right, then it's back to you, Jade. Okay, let's try over this side, let's see what we get. Okay. Oh, a road. Where are you gonna put that? You can't add to our collective road. No, I can't. But I can come off of this one, can't I? You can. And I'll take that, okay? Yep, all right, so this one's me. I'm gonna take from this side for once. And, oh, I've got a road here. I'm gonna take this one, 
and I'm going to add to that road there because that's three on the road there. I should have added to that one actually, come to think of it, but I still have enough meeples in my supply. All right, on to you, Jade. Okay, I'll take them over this side. Oh, more road. <laughs> um, I feel like all the roads are that side. I might go back that way yeah. in a minute. I'm just going to join that onto there. That's okay, really because you've already got that feature. Uh, I'm going to take this one. Ah, that's a nice one. I will, uh, ah, I can't add it to that city, unfortunately, because I'll be blocking there. So, I will Ooh. add to my road, and I will put a meeple in this city. Okay, I think I'm going to go back over this side. I don't want you Yeah, that road. side seems rubbish so far. Yeah. What have you got? I've got a double-sided city. Okay, that, that's not bad, because you could potentially complete a few things, couldn't you? I could. I'm going to go here. Okay, so you get to place a meeple first. Yep, so I'll just if you want, If you want to, I remember will. you don't have to. Right, then you can score features. So Jade actually has two features there that she's going to score. The big one is this one here. So as you can tell, it's completely surrounded, and you get nine points for a complete monastery. So take that one off, and you get nine points. That's 25. Oh, look at that, she's running ahead. And then you get to score this feature here, which is a city over two tiles that's just two four points. So get yourself four points, okay. there we go. And then take that meeple back. Okay, that's me done. Right, then it's back to me. So, yeah, I'm gonna try this side again. Let's see if it's a road side again. Ah, not too bad. Um, where do I want it though? I will go up here, and I'm gonna be risky and start another city. This is really bad news. I, I always do this, I start too many things, but let's see what I can get completed. Is that your last meeple? That is my last meeple. On to you Jade, which side are you going to pick from? I'm going to pick from here. Okay, I wouldn't. Ooh. Oh no, it was a really good one as well. <laughs> I'll pop that there. Ah, okay. Um, you can't place a meeple because I obviously it's that. Yeah. One thing we haven't talked about yet is farmers. If you were to lay down a meeple in the grass area, at the end of the game, that farmer is going to get three points for every complete city in its field. So what you do is you follow the green and see how many complete cities are in that field. So for example, that city is not in that field because it is blocked off by this road. But at the moment, there is one, two complete cities. That's worth six points. Did you want to do a farmer or is it too early game for you to do that? I think it's still a bit too early. Okay, quite a few times so if out. you're not placing a farmer, I'm just going to go ahead and score my lovely monastery that you completed for me. Thank oh you very goodness. much. So I get nine points, which puts me on 25. Okay, I'm catching up with you. Yeah. Right, uh, that's actually my go, so thanks for scoring that on your turn. Uh, okay, I've got this one. I really do need some meeples back, so I think I'm going to complete this one before it gets blocked. I'm going to get four points on that one, please. Oh, look at and this. I'm not placing anything else, so it's back to you, Jade. What are you going oh, to take? Okay, let's take from this side this time. Ooh. What do you got? A double-sided... Ah, see, there. they're really good ones, because you can complete one quite easily and then move on to the next city, or, obviously, you can add to that. You can even add to it and place a meeple on the other side. That is a very good idea. Good stuff. Or maybe I can link it round. Right, I'm going to go here again. <laughs> it's actually a road. Um, <laughs> I didn't think that was going to happen, but no, that's what's happening. Um, I'm going to place it on my road over here. So then it's back to you, Jade. Uh, let's take from here. Yeah. Okay, so I'm actually going to finish this one. Oh, nice. But firstly, you get to place some meeple. So do you want to take one of those three roads? I will take this one. Yeah. Okay. okay, and then you're going to score how many points for that city, Six, is that? Six, eight. Eight points, yeah, okay, so take that meeple off and get yourself eight. Oh, look at that, we were tied and now she's running away. <laughs> Rightio. Um, right, it can't be another road, surely. I did shuffle these before we started. Uh, no, good. Right, city. Um, I'm going to go ahead and complete that one over there, just so it's done. So I'm going to get four points for that one. Um... No, I was, I was tempted to place a farmer then, but I don't think I will. Right, go on then, Jade, it's on to you. Which side are you going to pick from? Go from here. Okay. Oh, look, it's a road. <laughs> a road. That wasn't from the pile I was choosing from, though. Um, so let's make this one a little bit longer. Yeah, why not? Why don't, well, just go into the score track, why don't you? <laughs> <laughs> Do you get infinity points if you link a road to the score track? I'd be well good if you did. That'd be good if you tap into the ultimate you go points. All board. <laughs> <laughs> right, all the board. All around the board. <laughs> you go all around the board. Oh, anyway, yeah, I'll carry on. Um, oh, I'm going to go this way. 
Okay, and Can then it's back to you. Out? No, I don't think no. so. No. I'll go this side this time. Oh, guess what? He's a road. No way. I'll go here this time. You're trying to link to my road? I'm going to take this one. Yes, look at that city. That's lovely, and that's going to go here. That's beautiful. For definite. Okay, go on then, Jade. This side this time. Yep. Oh, look at that bit of city. Nice where you're going to put it. I'm going to join it onto my city over here. Oh yeah, I didn't see that one. I thought you were going to put it there, but you've got two on the go. Oh, I have, yeah. Uh, you may, if you wanted to, take that little bit of road. You don't have to, obviously, but you could if you wanted to. I may well do. Okay. I'm going to take this tile here, and that is going to go in my city, and I'm going to add a worker to that road. I'm going to go from here this time. Okay. Oh, look at that, a bit more city. Nice, and again, you may, if you want to, add to that little bit of road. I think I'll leave the road. <laughs> gonna, yeah, because that's a bit enclosed, isn't it? It is worth noting at that point that even if you take something that you think will never get completed, at the end of the game, you will still score points for your roads up to where they kind of end. So, for example, if this end game, that would score me four points. And you get one point per city tile that is incomplete at the end. So, ideally, you want to complete your cities for more points, but don't worry too much about the roads. Okay, on to me. I'm going to take from this pile again. It's doing me good. Oh, it was doing me good. <laughs> um, I'm going to do that one. And I will take that bit of road there. Go on then, Jade, on to you. This goes from here. Yeah. Oh, look, add a bit more to my city. Why not? That's looking like a nice city there with two shields it in is. there. That's two doublers. Yeah. Is that a word? Doubler? Doubler. Doubler? No. Oh, no. I like one out. Um, I will add that to here, I think. Okay, on to you, Jade. Okay, let's try this pile this time. Oh, look, a bit more city. I think I'm going to move over that side in a minute. <laughs> You're doing way better. I think I'm going to pop that over here. <laughs> okay. And I'll claim that. Okay, we're going to have to move the score track in a minute, I see. Um, okay, so I will take this one this time. Just to note that the game will... Oh, look at that! Ah, oh, took a road. Uh, just to note that the game will end once all these tiles have finished. Um, I'm going to put this... Oh, do I mess up your city, but then add to your road? Uh, no, I will put this here, I think. And, yep, I'm done, so it's back to you. Okay, let's see what we get here. Oh, some more city there. <laughs> You're getting so lucky with your pools. I think I'll pop that there. Yeah, I thought you might. Do you want to put a meeple down? or? No, not? I think no? I'm going to leave it for the minute. Okay, I'm going to take from here. Oh, for goodness sake. No this road. is just my luck when I play this. Yeah, it is. It's another bit of road. Um, I'm going to put it in here, I think. Add to that bit there. Thinking about it, I should have put that one in there as well, and then I would have had a really long way yeah. by now. Never mind. You'll go. Try this pile. Okay. As now you can I'm tell, I'm not very good at this. More road. I'm ha, to the road. That's what you get. I should put that there. Okay. I'm going to take from this one this time. Come on, it can't be another road. Yeah, there we go. That's more like it. A bit of city. Um, I'll put it there. I think I am trying to make a nice city here. Uh, back to you, Jade. Oh, I think I'm going to go from this pile and get oh, more road. <laughs> I almost took from that pile as well, but I thought, no, I'm going to go over that, that way. there? Oh, she's trying to link our roads again. Um, I've got this one here. Do I just do it? I mean, she's going to link them eventually. Or do I do that? Nope, I can't do that. I could do that, though. There we go. I'm going to do that and add to that city there. Go on then, Jade. Back to you. Let's try this side this time. Okay. Anything nice? Oh no, our cities might end up linking. If our cities link, we will get... Oh no. That's my city. Okay. Oh look, she's going to link her own city. That might not be too great, but what can you do? Uh, okay, I'm going to take this one. And I will... I think I'll do that. So that my road, my road may link up, but... It doesn't matter too much. Right, Jade, it's on to you. Which side are you going to go for? This one. Okay. What is it? Oh, nice. Anything useful? Oh, no, no she's linked our roads. 
Well, I'm, I'm not going to take that city. No, okay. I will go with this one. <gasps> yes, that's a monastery. And I can complete that straight away. So, it's got a little bit of road on it. I'm gonna... <gasps> no, I can't complete it straight away because I haven't got... I haven't got a meeple. Oh, oh no. no! Okay, well, I am gonna put it in there because it's gonna help me out anyway. So I put it in there, I haven't got a meeple to place, and then I'm gonna score this feature. So I'm gonna take nine points for this one here. The reason why I can't use that one on that monastery is because you have to place a tile, then place a meeple, then score your features. So yeah, nine points for that one, and that will put me on 42. All right, back to you, Jade. Okay, let's see what I get from here. Okay. Uh, Anything good? Well, that's good. Uh, you know, that's a, a blocker or a, something you can yeah. cap. I mean, if, if you can't put it on that city, you have got um, a nice place where you can instantly complete yeah, a picture. Or oh, that one. Yes, yeah, so that's four points for you. One, two, three, four. On to you. Right. Uh, what pile should I take from this one? Oh, no, I do want that. Yeah, look, because that will link that okay. nicely. So yeah. even though I've got the same, but that is a very long road I've got going on there. You get double points for that or two. No, all you do is you see who's got the majority on that feature. So unfortunately, no, I won't get double points, but it's, you know, it's good enough as it is. All right, go on then, Jade, where are you going from? Here. Yep. Seriously. <laughs> what a bad tile. Although you could link some stuff up. Fin you could finish a particular road. No. Okay, you get to place a meeple, you could instantly get two points there. Yeah, I'll do that. Because if you placed it on there, you could then instantly take it off and score two points. So, do you want to take that off? I will take yeah. that off. You could, that is allowed. If you placed, placed a meeple and then it completed a feature, you could take it straight back off. And so, two points for it. Nicely done. Right, I'm going to go for this part again. This. <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. That's what I needed here. Unfortunately... Oh, I can only really put it there that will benefit me, but it will do. Okay, uh, back to you, Jade. Well, I'm going to try this one. Well, nicely done. That will complete your city, doesn't it? It links my cities and completes Oh, no! It. Okay, so that's big points. So if you take those two meeples off, because they're part of the same city, and then we're going to count that up. What is that? That's a huge city. That is 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16... 18, 20, 22, 24. Oh my goodness. So, one, two, three, four, so that's 67. Nice, so you go back around to 17, and you get one of those. Thank you very much. So that's the, the 50 tile, and on the other side, if you get more than 100 points, yeah, there you go. Hopefully she won't get as many as that, but we'll see. Right, I'm gonna grab this one, and that's a very, that would have been great there, but unfortunately, it blocks that road. Yeah. So I think I will do that. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, and do I take the end there? Yeah, go on then, why not? Uh, there aren't many tiles left, so score some features at the end of the game, even if it is for half points. What do you got there, Jade? Mm. That's a nice one. It is, I think I'll go here and get myself four yep. points. So play, go there, place a meeple, and then score a feature. And then that comes straight back off. Right, I'm going to do this one. So, oh, that's not too bad. I'm going to add to this city, because I might be able to complete that one, but not that one. I've made that far too big. Go on then, Jade, back to you. I'll go from this side. Ooh. That's a good one. It is. These get points at the end of the game as well, and they get one for every tile around it, including itself as well. I think I might put it in here. Okay. And then might, put, might be hard to complete that, but... But at the end of the game, you're still going to get eight points for yeah. it, even though there's one gap. So it's not too bad. I'm going to grab this one. Ah, that's nice. Although I don't have a meeple this time. Um, da -da 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 -da. You didn't have one on the last one either. No, I'm just going to put that in there, because it, it looks like it belongs there. Go on then, Jade, it's your go. Okay, let's um, go from here. It's a road. Where are you going to put it? You've got a road here that's already on the go. I've got a road here as well. Oh no, I haven't. But that's the one that we're sharing. So do you want to add to our shared one or do you no, want to add to... Yeah, I thought you might want to add to your own one. Um, okay, I'm going to take this one. Uh, do I... Com no, I'm not going to complete our road. I'm not going to benefit us. We're not on us. Right, I'm going to place that there. And then I'm going to complete this feature here, which is just three points for that road. So one, two, three. 
Okay, Jade, it's back to you. Right. Haven't got many tiles left now, so keep watching, see who ends up winning. It's definitely going to be Jade, but just, just watch anyway. Um, what have so... you got? That's a nice one. Yeah, thanks. Instant two-pointer. If you was to put it on a... Yeah, let's do that. I'll pop that yeah. there. Well, and then you're going to score that one in the middle there. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so instant two points for you. Uh, yeah, put it on and then take it off again. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm going to take this one here. That's interesting. Um, do I... Oh, that will complete yours as well. I really need to complete my own one. Um, let's go here. And I'm going to score two points with this one. And just get, yeah, two points instant. Right, back to you, Jade. Let's take this one. Oh. <laughs> Wrong way, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Is there any sort of bits of city that I can get? No. Not really. I mean, you could start a new one and get end game points, maybe, but. Ah, does that complete a road? It does. Oh, firstly, you get to play some meeple if you want to. No, not on the road. Oh, sorry. Firstly, you get to play some meeple if you want to. I'll put it on there. And then you get to score that complete feature, which is okay. that road. Okay, and that's one, two, three. Three points. All right, she's running away now. I desperately need to catch up. A couple more turns and that will be it. Um, oh, where can this go? I think I'm just going to go here and get an instant two points again. So I'm on 49. I'm almost on 50. Go on then, Jade. Back to you. Let's try this one. What have you got? A bit of city? bit of city. Yeah, let's put it there. Okay. I'm going to go with this one here. Uh, oh. I can complete a city over here. So if I go there, firstly I'm going to place this one down on there, and then this one's going to score four points. So I'm on 53, yay, I get one of these tokens. Right, Jade, it is back to you. We have five tiles remaining. Okay, I will just add that onto there. Oh, with a crest as well. So those ones with the shield, at the end of the game, they still double that tile, so that's actually worth two points at the end of the game when we score for incomplete cities. Which one of the four shall I go for? This one, I think. Oh, that's not too bad. Um, do, 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 do. do I want to complete that? No, no. okay, all right, I'm gonna add to that city. And I'm gonna take that bit of road because we haven't got many turns left. Back to you, Jade. I'll try this one. Look at that. Oh, nice. Um, I think I will just pop it on there. Yeah. And then you can take a you can take that bit of road if you want. It's going to be an extra point at the end of the it game. It will be, yeah. Right, I've got two tiles left. Well, one for me, one for Jade. I'm going to grab this one. Uh, yeah, that's not too bad. I'll take that. And then Jade, it is on to you. It's still not the right piece. <laughs> I'll pop that on there. Just going to do that. And you can take the road. I will take the road. You might as well, because you can place it. Okay, so we have run out of tiles. So that is officially the end of the game. We just need to do some end game scoring. Jade, we're going to start with you, because you're in front. So let's do your incomplete features. So this one's going to be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So take that off, Take give yourself seven points. Okay. Yep. This one here is going to come off and give you eight points. Yep. This one here is going to get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, but for both of us. And I'll just go ahead and add mine on as well. You part, you're on a hundred. You're straight hundred. Oh my word. Okay, I cannot catch up with that. Right, and then you've got uh, one road there and one road there, so that's two points. Yeah. And then this city here. So if you take that one off, you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven points for that incomplete city. So what does that leave you on? 109. 109. I am definitely not going to catch up with 109. Right, let's see what we got. So I've got 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. But unfortunately that's for both of those. So that is uh, on me 72, I think. Yeah. <laughs> right, I'm going to get one point for this city. Yeah. I'm going to get one point for this road. And I'm going to get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 for that city. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight for that city. Nicely done. So that is 87 to 109. 
Congratulations, Jade. Well done for winning. Guys, if you want more carcass on, let me know. Which one of these expansions would you like to see next? I know you don't know the names particularly, but if there's any that catch your eye, let me know in the comments below which one you would like to see next. Thanks so much for watching Carcassonne and we will catch you on the next video.